a little farm update here. We are still waiting on babies. We've got the heavy bred girls that are in kitten stalls. We got two Kikos in here. They're pretty far along. We got a big dappled boar over in here. I am waiting on her to drop her babies any day. We got two kids that were born back in January that their mama got pulled down real bad. So we went ahead and weaned them at 60 days. They're doing good. They've been off their mama for about a week now. And then we got two more dapple boar yearlings in here in the hay barn. Um, they're pretty far along too. She, uh, her body condition isn't as good as I'd like it to be. And they're, they're yearlings. I'm not sure if they really should have been bred this year, but we'll see if they make it. She's, I'd say she's got twins with her. I'd say she's got a single. At least I hope so. Still looking pretty good on hay. Been feeding alfalfa to the mamas that have babies. We only got one with baby on her right now. And she was an accident. She's an auction goat. Um, then she was here for like two days and had a a kid and these are all gear windows that didn't get bred this year that's another auction goat probably i'm gonna get away from the auction goats then two kids over in that other stall this is their mama she was just pulled down real bad so we uh we took her and stuck her in here by herself to try to get some weight on her she is one of our cools this year i know she gave us two twins but she's an older doe has some health issues She's going to the meat market. And then this is uh, one of them auction goats that had a baby right after they got here. He's doing good. It's a little buck kid. The mother two kids in this stall are nannies. Then we'll go show you the cool pen. Um, we're gonna get rid of our buck this year and a couple nannies that just have some health issues. And we're gonna send them to the meat market. They're good looking goats, they really are, but they just got some health issues. And not stuff I'm looking for my herd, but we're gonna get rid of him. Good luck. His name's Studley, he's a year and a couple months old. All these are a little over a year old. And Nubian, Nubian and an Alpine, they're crossed with a Kiko, and he's Alpine Kiko. Missing a little bit of his ear, calls a buddy. But that is the goat update right now. We're currently waiting on kids. Highly anticipating them. I don't know if they'll be here this week or the week after, but 150 days from when we turned the buck in was last Monday, the 28th of March. And it is, I think, the 3rd or 4th of April. These girls, I don't think we'll have theirs as soon as this dapple right here. I'm excited to get her kids. I really hope we get a good buck out of her. But she is far along. She's an older doe, though. She may end up getting cold, too, once she raises her baby. I think she's in a little bit of discomfort. We're going to get behind her and check her rear end and see how bad she's up. Uh, see if there's anything happening with her end parts. <laughs> Hey, sweetheart. I don't know. Let's see it. Let's see it. Come on. I gotta eat behind you, honey. I don't see any discharge. But it's definitely swollen. Her bag is swollen. Um, she is far along. Nice. Poop for the camera. I really do believe it to be any day, but my goodness, her bag is huge, huge, huge. All righty. Well, that's all I got for today. She's bred. She's an older dapple doe, but uh, she didn't get bred till December. Um, so she'll be later in June before she has hers. 
we seen we saw her get bred and she's got me thinking she may have got bred about the same time too um because her vulva is a little swollen but most of these girls i know for sure didn't get bred or had abortion the little blackhead one had an abortion they weren't supposed to get bred anyway so but yeah that's all i got for today we'll uh catch you on the next one hope you enjoyed this video if you want another update just like it and leave a comment let me know but i'm probably gonna post some once we get some babies